hey 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 team how are we all doing it is tuesday today i am just about to sit down and film a video my camera and lighting setup here i am about to embark on the mammoth task that is sorting through my po box and unboxing all press samples that i've been sent over the past couple of weeks yesterday gleam sent me my po box in a sack literally this turned up at my door i haven't had a look in yet so i thought it'd be cool to unbox it today but also this is so bad I also have this humongous pile here that I also need to sort out. So that is the task. I needed to do this anyway, but I thought I might as well film me unboxing it um, to kind of kill two birds with one stone. It means that I'm sorting my life out by sorting all of this out um, and also making content. I think I'm also going to film another Dates with Kate today after this. I don't know what else to film. I'm in a bit of a rut at the moment um, and I thought that I haven't done one in a couple of weeks and it might be cool to update you on another date that I went on which was an absolute fail. So if you want to see some of the new in beauty products I've been sent recently go and check out my main video that will have gone up on Sunday. Ooh, I've just finished filming the main bulk of the video but now I need to film the close-ups and sort this out. Look at this. Oh my god. Literally looks like a bomb has gone off in this room. There's been so much sex toys i got sent sex toys in my po box so happy about it yeah i need to sort my life out now I'm big time this is gonna take a while i've just made some lunch doesn't look that great but i'm planning to eat again before i go out to circus later i've got mushroom quiche and some savoy cabbage and broccoli with like spices and turmeric and it's delicious I've just made myself a coffee in my new mug that was in my PO box. It's from Anthropology. How cute is that? Really nice. I'm also trying to um, be a bit more healthy with my snacks because normally after lunch I'm like, right, I need a biscuit with a cup of tea. Um, but obviously I've given up biscuits for Lent, so I've got myself an orange and a pear to have with my coffee. Not sure I'm going to eat them because I know I do have some Ferrero Rocher's in my bedside table. I've got two left. I mean, that's a potential option for a snack as well. <gasps> I have now left my house and I'm on my way to circus. Um, I look so greasy, I need to wash my hair tonight. Yeah, I feel like I haven't done much today apart from film that video, but I did um, tidy my room a bit and got rid of loads of recycling stuff as well and sorted some samples out in general, so. Tomorrow we'll be more productive. It's Wednesday today and my sister has just got here. We are filming a lookbook today. We're filming a coffee date cafe outfit lookbook, which I'm really excited about. My sister's going to film it for me. We're going to go in on in the bit into some of my favourite cafes. So it'll also be like a coffee travel guide for this area of London. Um, I've got my outfit sorted out, but I just want to get my sister's approval before I put them on. Have I got scissors? somewhere these are my outfits i've got like a well actually i'm gonna flash that and then not gonna show you the rest we've been recording and filming all day it's now four o'clock we've got one more outfit to film so we're gonna go to the last cafe bar now we've come to a bar that i've been on on the first date before yeah it's really cool in here super trendy if you want to know what bar it is i've got myself a desperados then watch the full video Becky's setting up the shot with my mulps. I am home now. My sister's gone. <laughs> I had a bit of an accident with fake tan this morning. <laughs> Look at that. 
Oh, I'm such a fail. I uh, made pasta bake. Look at this bad boy. Top tip for pasta bakes, put some crisps on top because then it crunches up. It's not good for you, but it tastes bloody brilliant. We're playing Boggle. We're playing Boggle. Who won Boggle? You did. I did. Did you hear that? You won Boggle. Oh, Boggle. Um, we're just going to try and get this um, off my face. Oh, wow, it looks really bad right now. We're going to try. I Googled it. It says lemon juice. Do you want to do it for me? It's quite prominent. Oh, it's so bad. How did I go out like this? I one of those mums that spits on a tissue and wipes <laughs> their kid's face. Would you do that for me? I don't really do it. Well, that's not, that's not working at all, is it? Hang on, just a little bit more, I think. My, my whole face is going to smell like lemon juice. <laughs> what else have we got here that we could use? Um, Sugar. Salt. Salt. Turmeric? No, that will stain even more. Can salt. you crash up some salt on that and use it as an exfoliator with some lemon juice? Right, I've mixed a handful of rock salt with some lemon juice and you've got to scrub it off. It's going to hurt, babe. Oh, well, that's gritty. It's all falling down. <laughs> it's a lot of... Oh, why is it not coming off? Is it a birthmark? <gasps> Maybe... It's working. No, it's not. No, it's not. You're right. It's so orange. There's salt going all <laughs> over me. Look how much I've got in my hand. Oh. <clears throat> Imagine if that. <laughs> you forgot. You forgot so it was salty, salty and lemony. Oh. No, it doesn't, it doesn't work. You know, hopefully I'll ha I'll have it off by the time this video goes live. But if if I don't, can you please leave some comments down below? Let me know how get this off it's saturday today um our G uh, plans today were supposed to be go to the gym we have um decided not to go to the gym and instead go to a food market and get a bloody mary for brunch and some food around the borough market area so yeah i'm really looking forward to it also look at these beautiful flowers isn't that just springtime in a bouquet? We are in Borough Market. We have come here for lunch. Gore is busy today. Yeah. This is the best Bloody Mary I've had in my entire life. I'm so excited for another one. And we've got a table right next to the window overlooking Borough Market. Oh my god. Uh, Cheers, babe. Chin chin. You cannot beat it. beat it. That is just the best Bloody Mary ever. Apart from that cucumber. Oh no. I think we're gonna have something from roast. I am currently eating the best sandwich I've ever had in my entire life. Roast pork with all the apple sauce, apple puree, green slaw, apple molasses. Oh my god, it's so good. Oh my god, look at these. Roast potatoes. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, okay, go for it, go for it. That looks hot. Oh my god. <laughs> Mom. Eat that, eat that, eat that. No, it's too hot. Was that the best lunch you've ever had? Best lunch ever had. So good. And um, we're now getting some of our favourite. The best dessert you've ever had. The best dessert I've ever had. This is the best day of my life. And um, we're gonna get a punch pack brownie, which is my favourite, my favourite brownie ever. God. Oh, it's windy. We're walking. 
walking to St. Catherine's Dock to go to the pub with my parents and my sister and her fiance. And I'm really looking forward to it. The sky looks purple tonight. We're just having a stroll through St. Catherine's Dock on the way to the pub. Oh, it's so beautiful around here. A really lovely, peaceful part of London. There's loads of boats hidden away and this beautiful pub which is all lit up. It's still called the Dickens Inn. I think I've only been there once before for pizza, but it was really nice. Dude's just got a new phone and the pictures it takes are just incredible. Oh, that looks like it was taken on a profesh camera. We're playing cards. Happy birthday to Jay. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Had a lovely evening out with uh, the parents, and now we're back at G's. We are having. The cakes that we bought earlier from Conditor and Cook. I've got a fudge pack of brownie. She has got an apple, I think it's a toffee apple crumble, which looks amazing. It's like 11 o'clock, but we're gonna watch an episode of Game of Thrones and then go to sleep. King's London is London. Winterfell is Yorkshire. Okay. Sunday, we are at our first dance class. Ow. <laughs> Um, ow. Um, yeah, we're learning Charleston, are we? I think so. Charleston Lindy Hop. And now we go back, forward, forward and back. Back, forward, forward and turn, forward and turn, forward and turn. <laughs> double kick, double kick. Maybe you look so All messed up in your face. Oh my god, what is just it's hailing? <laughs> I literally sunny, just got my camera sunny. out and it started hailing. What is happening? What is going on? Literally just turned my camera on, it started hailing down. Um how was dance class? I really enjoyed it. Love Charleston. We're landing in Charleston, it's really cool. Oh my god, look at this! I don't know if my camera's gonna pick it up. Whoa. That is, oh, it's stopping, it's stopping, kind of. Learning the, oh God, really zoomed in. <laughs> now we're going to meet G's mate for lunch. Oh my God, I can't breathe. Yeah. It is Monday, lunchtime, and we are at a wedding dress shop. My sister trying on wedding dresses today. I'm so excited. We're at Wed to Be in Chelmsford. Um, first up. But it's just the fish tail that's not. They all choosing some more dresses to try on. You can just hear them giggling. Um, I'm so hangry right now. Yeah. Are you hangry? No. Look how young you look in my camera. Um, are you having a fun day? Yeah. You know what this is missing? Huh? You know what this is missing? What? Prosecco. Oh god, yeah. Oh, it's toast. Where's the Prosecco? prosecco. It's a Prosecco. What is wedding dress shopping without Prosecco? Prosecco. Prosecco. I think she's found the dress. Yay! That was so easy, Becky. <laughs> yeah, you look good in everything. See, wasn't it worth it having another, yeah. another go? Oh, I love it. I love it. I think for you it's perfect. Yay! We found a day! No. This headband, I look ridiculous. I got home at 7 o'clock after a long day to spend the evening having a bit of a chill and filling out my diary. I bought this at the beginning of the year. It's a like line a day five year diary and I had a five year diary when I was younger. I remember I loved it. It was like green tartan but I, know, I don't think I ever actually finished doing it. But I absolutely love diaries and 
the idea of like looking back through them like in years to come but i'm awful at writing a diary entry every evening like i just won't do it um but this is like one or two lines about your day and then you can read it back the next year so i hadn't filled it in for like a month or so so i went back through my calendar and through my photos and through my vlogs and kind of um jotted some memories down so it's laid out like this so there's five um entries and every year you just put the little date next to it and then write some things about your day and i'm really really looking forward to next year being able to look back on the day before i just think it's a really nice idea i got it from amazon so yeah i'll leave a link to that down below if any of you want to copy i guess you can start at any time really don't you don't have to start at the beginning of the year that took a couple of hours i started watching season 10 of rupaul's drag race which was great but now i am going to go to bed i'm going to take my makeup off really happy with my skin at the moment it's looking really good apart from something going on under my nose i think that scar cream is still really working i hope you've enjoyed this vlog and i'll see you next week